Good evening to everybody from beautiful Los Angeles, California. It's always awesome to be here in the City of Angels and to be able to uh, be with my colleagues, the uh, co-founders and co-owners of By Design for some incredible meetings. Boy, this week has been a phenomenal week for By Design. On October the 1st, as I'm sure that nearly all of you were present with us on the soft launch of our hybrid e-commerce platform, The Boss Club. You know, in my career in network marketing, I have seen, at least I used to say, I think I've seen almost everything. But what I saw go down on Thursday night, I had never seen that before. Because with the launch of our hybrid e-commerce platform, Heck, or the Boss Club, we saw more than 200 new product SKUs launched and introduced into our By Design family. I've never seen anything like that before. I've been, I've been in companies where we might have launched three products, maybe four, maybe five, but to launch more than 200 products all at one time, unbelievable. And we're so very grateful that we have had such excitement, such passion, such interest in what we're doing at By Design with the Boss Club and what that's going to mean to everybody. So that's not the purpose of what we're talking about tonight, of course, but I just had to make a comment that it's been such a remarkable last few days since we were all together on soft launch night of October the 1st. But tonight, we get to have the great privilege once again of having a travel discussion with Rob Baker, a true expert, someone who knows what you could actually say, Rob has forgotten more about the travel industry than most the rest of us will ever know. That is a different way of saying we've got a world-class expert who really knows his business. Every single time I have personal conversations with Rob, that is brought home to me once again that Rob is a true world-class expert in every element of travel. And without a doubt, Rob is one of the finest leaders in the entire profession of network marketing, no matter what part of the world we're talking about when it comes to a travel offering. And what Rob has prepared for by design is going to be a remarkable part of our future growth and future momentum of the company. When I first came to by design, of course, we were all talking in very excited terms about what it's going to look like, what it's going to feel like as we become a billion dollar company. all of you to know on this call, the foundations that have been put in place, the pillars that are supporting by design, it is absolutely not going to be merely a single billion dollar company. This is going to be a multi-billion dollar brand and I don't have any hesitation whatsoever to say that with the expertise, the knowledge and the passion that Rob Baker has, the travel sector of our business proposition at By Design can absolutely be a very significant part of that multi-billion dollar brand that we're going to be building over the years to come. Of course, we've all been in a situation for the last several months where travel has really been turned upside down on its head. We get that. We understand that. Our hearts go out to everybody, literally millions of people around the world that have been impacted in a negative way by the coronavirus pandemic, most especially to those people that have lost family members, friends, loved ones to this terrible disease of COVID-19. But that is going to turn around. The time is coming soon that as we continue to do what we need to do, we follow the voices of science and reason, 
we're going to be able to get a hold of this pandemic. And when that happens, travel is going to explode crazy. Rob and I have had these discussions before, and I know that Rob feels very bullish on what is going to be happening to the travel industry. It's starting to come back right now, little by little. It's clearly not back, and it may ultimately take another year or two to really get going in a great, fantastic way like travel used to be. In my opinion, that even puts us in a better positioning at, by design that we can take advantage of the tremendous opportunities that Rob gives to all of us at By Design, and we can absolutely be ready to go when the doors to the travel industry are open wide again. So I personally am so enthusiastic, feeling even passionate about the role that travel will be able to play in the multi-vertical approach that we continue to move forward with it by design. So Rob, with your expertise, your world-class reputation, I'll turn the mic to you now to give us your next installment of your travel business and the tips and the hints that you're gonna share with us tonight. It's an honor for me to turn the mic now to a world-class travel leader, Rob, like you. So take it away. All right, thanks, Dave. And thanks everybody for being on this week's Travel Talk. I wanna uh, once again, thank By Design for their incredible partnership in supporting uh, our travel program and our travel product. And so we're just gonna go ahead and get right into our presentation. And we got a lot of information to cover in a short period of time. Hopefully you'll take some notes and I believe this is obviously being recorded, so it will be available to review uh, at another time. And then also I would highly recommend that you get this training in this travel talk uh, to, to people in your organization. So today we're gonna talk about some of the Corona traveling updates, uh, talk a little bit about the Premier Echo Lifestyle dashboard. We're actually gonna talk about the Echo program today. We're also going to talk about our new product in the United States, the Travel Agent Training and Travel Agent Business System, and then also talk about something that a lot of people don't know about, and that is what's known as familiarization trips. Trips that we'll talk a little bit about for those of you that are in the United States or for anyone that's globally and you know anyone in the United States, this is going to be a phenomenal product uh, to get your team on. So first of all, let's talk a little bit about what's been happening on the Corona travel update. It's been a lot of ups and downs. Uh, you'll notice that there'll be some countries that open up, some countries that close. Um, and it's just all over the board right now. Everyone's taking their precautions. Uh, right now, international travel is something that is definitely not really transpiring globally. However, in the United States, We are absolutely getting slammed uh, on our travel company side with requests of people going to Cabo and uh, going to Cancun uh, for weekend getaways. And so travel is definitely happening from the United States to Mexico. There are certain Latin America countries that are available and some Caribbean locations available. Uh, what I really recommend that you do if you live in the United States and you're looking to travel abroad, uh, just Google uh, government travel restrictions, and that'll bring up some government guidelines on what's going on in the different countries around the world of where you can travel, where you can't travel, and then who's got some of these really strange quarantine requirements. Uh, like, for example, Hawaii. Uh, Hawaii is looking to end their terrible 14-day quarantine uh, requirement next month, uh, if not maybe in a couple of weeks. Uh, basically, if you're coming into Hawaii from any other state, uh, you have to actually go check into a hotel for 14 days, and nobody's going to do that. So Hawaii's economy has been completely destroyed as a result of that. And we understand that they want to be overly cautious, but uh, once again, you know, the tourism industry in Hawaii, that's really what the islands are built upon is tourism. So it's had a huge impact, and I know that Hawaii is getting ready to open soon. And I'm going to really recommend that 
when Hawaii does open, uh, that's a destination you really want to consider. And I'm also going to be rec recommending to by design that we actually take into consideration of doing a, a drinkation, a team dream, a drinkation, a by design team dreamcation uh, to Hawaii and then also to Latin America. Um, so we're looking at basically other countries opening up, uh, no doubt first quarter of 2021, probably in February. Now Dave talked about it's gonna take over a year for travel to get back to normal. Um, that may be the case in terms of what we're accommodated and used to. However, people are gonna be traveling way before then. Matter of fact, um, it's been projected right now that people are traveling at least on an average uh, 50 percent of travelers are going to travel twice before the end of the year for holidays and a getaway and people are already planning their 2021 uh, vacations when it comes to international countries it's country by country you just got to get a hold of uh, your your in-country government regulation travel and tourism uh, website and, and inquire in regards to in your particular country where you can travel out of. When it comes to airlines in the United States, the airline industry and the cruise industry have been tremendously impacted. Uh, the airlines just announced major layoffs, which is going to reduce flights. Uh, in addition, you have to wear a mask during your entire flight. Uh, they actually do a temperature reading before you get on to the flight. Uh, so make sure that prior to your departure on any airline, just check and assure that that airline is on time. Uh, make sure you sign up for the airline notification programs that they could text you any updates. And then once again, make sure you have all the protocols uh, when going to check in at, at TSA. So you're not caught in a situation to where you don't get on to the flight. Uh, but we're anticipating that flights are going to become more packed, which I find quite interesting. Um, they're talking about social distancing everywhere else, but you can't sit six feet apart from somebody on an airplane. And if you take a look at some pictures, they're still pretty tight. They have some empty seats in between, but for the most part, it's uh, all masks on your airlines. When it comes to cruises, uh, the cruise industry also has taken a huge hit. Uh, we've gotten some update information on some things on what to expect in the cruise line industry, which I'll share with you in a minute. Uh, but let me tell you a little bit about what's happening in Las Vegas. Uh, Las Vegas has taken its first important step to safely allow uh, for the starting and reopening of meeting space. Um, you may or may not know this, but in Las Vegas, and this is global too, a lot of people from Asia come over to, to Las Vegas for gambling and conventions and that's been obviously a major uh, impact so they're looking at uh, starting to allow small announced that they're going to be opening up october actually they opened it up this this last weekend uh to where you can actually conduct conference room space of a limit of 250 people to a thousand uh, divided by subrooms of 50% occupancy and requiring social disk, mask, and temperature checks. So once again, things are starting to move in a direction of getting not only the economy going, but getting back into a place where people can do meetings and conferences and hopefully by design we'll be able to uh, eventually be able to have an event real soon where we could all get together. I talked about cruises. Here are some of the changes. This is a, uh, information from Norwegian Cruise Line. Um, and they're basically saying that there's no doubt going to be some changes in the cruise line industry. Uh, they're hoping that the majority of buffets, which no doubt cruise lines are known for, are gonna continue to, to, make, to be uh, remain. However, obviously there will be a lot more uh, precautions in regards to, you know, people accessing the food. Um, also, there's going to be some changes in, on onboard on activities. Um, they want to make sure that they kind of reduce what's called floor traffic. And uh, bottom line, they, what they want to do is try to make it as a safe experience as possible. But the positives in a cruise line is that 
there's a lot of space on a cruise line, especially on the larger cruises. And they are adding new medical facilities. Every cruise line is now creating what are called um, isolation zones in places where they can take people that may have any symptoms of corona and basically quarantine those passengers. Uh, so that way it doesn't affect the whole ship. So you're going to see a lot of protocols in the cruise line industry globally uh, in regards to enhanced medical facilities. Um, when they find somebody that has any symptoms, they're going to be quarantined right away. And those are called medical zones that they're going to be incorporating. They're also going to be uh, increasing their physicians on all the ships. So it's real important to understand that opportunity. And when I talked earlier on passenger space ratio, um, basically how this kind of works is that they're going to calculate how many people could be on a ship by dividing what's called the vessel tonnage and its capacity. That's kind of how they're going to figure that out in addition to what they call square footage. Uh, so the key here is that if you're looking to take a cruise, get on the larger ships. Don't get on the smaller ships. Uh, now, obviously, if you're looking to do a river cruise, those are somewhat smaller, uh, but river cruises also have their own uh, precautions in terms of the amount of cabins that they're going to actually make available for those experiences. So look at this right now in terms of cruises are taking bookings now uh, for 2021. And I'll tell you, there are some unbelievable deals uh, on the cruise lines uh, for, for those that are interested in taking a look at that. Now, once again, I've actually shown this before. Um, the statistics still remain the same in terms of what people are looking for. Uh, in traveling, the number one thing people are looking for are deals and discounts. Now, as a by design Premier Echo Lifestyle subscriber, do you get savings? So we've actually provided you a product that meets the number one thing that the consumer's looking for. So travel savings is huge. Traveling to places that have Corona safety. And like I said, I just told you what the airlines and cruise lines are doing previously. We've talked about what the hotels are doing. Uh, they're looking for things to do, activities, outdoors specifically. Uh, so outdoors, fun, and then also road trips. Even though some people are, are taking a, a, an air flight, a huge majority of travelers, the ones that are traveling, over 70% are looking to drive. And basically what we found through our target market is just, this is real simple. Looking for travel deals with Corona safety, driving with the 300 miles, and looking more for the luxury accommodations, which is great because if you're not paying for airline tickets, and let's say you have a family, that could be very expensive. So you can offset those airline costs and stay in a higher uh, type of a quality a location destination, including your activities. So you may want to consider what we call the drivecations, uh, doing things to where you could drive and the statistics is within 300 miles. Let's just take a quick review of the dashboard. Um, for those of you that have attended our weekly workshop, which is every Wednesday at uh, 7 p.m. Pacific, I believe, you want to make sure that you're on that training because we go through this particular dashboard in detail. Today, I'm just gonna give you a highlight overview of the dashboard of benefits. Now, the first thing that I wanna let you know is depending upon where you are around the world, your dashboard opens up with benefits that are related to your country. For example, when you take a look at our specialty services, uh, we have preferred merchants, preferred destinations, travel insurance, and celebrate registry. The only place travel insurance isn't available is Canada, Australia, and Europe, and Asia. It is available all throughout Latin America, where I know we actually have uh, a large group of people, and it's available in the United States. So if you don't see travel insurance listed, it's because it's not available in your country. And we'll be working on a solution for that because it's real important, everybody, 
that if you're booking a major trip, a major vacation, don't rely upon the generosity of the supplier to give you a refund or to give you a credit if there's more corona related issues in the future. Always get travel insurance if you have an expensive trip, it's totally worth it. Also, we have Celebrate Registry, which is a unique tool that has nothing to do with travel. It's a great tool to create an event and that event could be a birthday party, it could be um, a graduation, it could be a retirement, it could be even a, a wedding. And similar to the concept of a wedding registry where you may register with a brand name uh, vendor, like Macy's, for example, for those in the United States know Macy's, you can have somebody uh, buy your wedding gift at Macy's and they know what you want, similar to what that does. It allows you and your family to create a unique celebration page that you can actually have people buy a birthday gifts or, or provide cash. So this way it helps with the issue of people not being able to get together uh, because of the Corona issue. So you could have literally virtual celebrations. And also I wanna to touch upon one thing before we move on to the high touch is our preferred merchants. Now understand the importance of this. When you're promoting the Premier Echo Lifestyle subscription, do not promote this as just travel alone. Don't promote this as a travel club. We want to really promote this as a lifestyle experience. And what I mean by lifestyle is not just what you can save when you're traveling, but what you can save on things that you're doing daily. And we need your help, everybody, because we are not, as a US-based company, in every single country knocking on doors of businesses. So as a by design entrepreneur, you guys have an opportunity to design your dashboard. What benefits would you like to benefits to us by sending an email to support at premiertravelsavings.com and we'll see about adding it, but look for benefits that have nothing to do with travel. And that's why we have TravelogyMerchant.com. This provides you an opportunity to go to local restaurants, go to the dry cleaners, the car wash, retail stores, any traditional business you could think of. All these businesses are trying to get customers to come back into their business. And they're advertising. They're offering discounts. I know in the United States, advertisement and coupons are a big deal for vendors. I don't know how it is around the world, but I would still assume that businesses around the world want to get the word out about their business to entice customers to come in. So what we do is we provide a database to where whatever country you're in, you can go to any business owner or someone that may be the decision maker and say, hey, how would you like to advertise for free, no cost, to our private community of lifestyle subscribers. And when you advertise for free, you're just giving our people some type of a savings. You know, 20, 30%, two for one, free appetizer, whatever it may be, some type of value. And then when the member, the subscriber, such as yourself, goes into the business, to show that that offer is valid, you just log in on your mobile device into your dashboard and show them the offer. That's how simple it is. So this is important because if we could create a large value proposition outside of travel, this will help people save money every day. And every day they're saving a little bit of money adds up every month. And if they're saving every month and they stay consistent for the year, they're gonna, with travel alone and the, the daily stuff, they can save two to three times of what the subscription fee is. Because I can tell you everybody, this program works if you use it. And don't get in the trap of saying it's just a travel program. It's not, it's beyond that. Also for the high touch benefits, I wanna make sure that you know that that's a high touch service, meaning offline reservation. Do not use that for last minute bookings. Use that only when you have enough time 
to book it like a week to 10 days out, except for groups. If you're looking to book a group, you need to book that 30 to 60 days in advance. So understand that this is to get high tech service with a travel provider in your country. So don't use that service and fill out all the data on that. If you're looking to travel last minute or if it's just for example, a hotel, go to your booking engine to do that. Also on the high tech benefits, entertainment, sporting events and concerts. That's a ticket broker where you save 10%. Not a lot of savings, but it adds up. That is only available for United States and Canada. Online shopping rebates, once again, providing cash back on things that you purchase online, in addition to savings on things that you could purchase online, everything you could think of outside of travel. That's available pretty much all over the world. Also, we have a rental car engine, specifically just for global rental cars, and then obviously the Premier Travel Savings. I wanna remind everybody that the Premier Travel Savings offers a lot of value in itself. Now, the first thing that you wanna do when you come into this platform is make sure you click on the, over on the far right, your language and currency. Also take the time to read the price guarantee program. Click on support because when you're using this booking engine, the best support you can get for this is in live chat or set up a reservation with a concierge. Also, when you're checking out uh, uh, on support, try to document everything that you're looking to do in terms of your request. Don't just we're, think about making a phone call, document everything so we have uh, some form of actual documentation of what it is that you're trying to, to get resolved. Also on your account, remember you could have two people as a subscriber, yourself and a secondary. Uh, that could be somebody that's over 21 years old with a credit card. They can be your spouse, significant other, it could be adult child, it could be a business partner, whoever but both parties have to have credit cards on file uh, in your name. You can't book for third party people that are not traveling with you. Also, once again, on our cruise section, uh, we have uh, ocean cruises, cruise packages, river cruises, sailboats and yachts. Take a look at all the other benefits that are there, but also keep in mind activities. Activities in the majority of countries around the world, you can actually uh, do things in your own backyard without traveling. So take a look at things that you can do that you may not have known that's available without even having to travel. And then golfing. We have a great golf platform in a lot of countries around the world, not all the countries, but for countries that can participate with it, it's another area of value. Now let's get into cash rewards, the echo. We get questions about this all the time. Let me explain how this works. There's two ways that you generate what are called reward credits. The first way is through anything you personally book on the booking engine. Now you have your dashboard, right? Only the booking engine part of the dashboard counts towards generating personal reward credits on your personal travel. So not only do you save the most amount of money, but we give you 0.1 to 0.15 of the value of what it is that you paid for. And it's like frequent flyer miles. It's small dollar amounts, but it adds up over time to lead to future free travel. And then for your Echo, for those of you that log into your By Design back office, click into product, click, in, click into Premier Echo subscription dashboard, you're gonna find where you are able to email those Echoes out. And here's how this work. When you send an Echo invitation, you're inviting your prospect to register for free, to have access to 50% of the normal available savings. Now they're not gonna know that, they're only gonna see the savings. But know that whatever they save, you're gonna get that balance of 50% of savings in what's reward credit. So let's give you an example. Let's say you invited me to become an Echo subscriber with you. I create an account, create a password, log in, and now I go to a modified website. It's not the dashboard, it's only a few features, including the hotels. I wanna look at Miami. So I take a look at four day, uh, five days, four nights in Miami. I take a look at who's got the best online price there. So we show you all the best online price with taxes. 
And we notice that the best online price, they're all about the same, but we'll just use booking.com. Now, as your customer, I'm excited to know that I could save $457. But if I save $457, you're going to generate $457 in reward credits. However, based on the fact that our reward credits are calculated on our 0.01 calculation, you kind of have to reverse it to know your total points. So in this case, you'd have 45,700 reward credits. Because if you took 45,700 reward credits and divided it by 0 0.01, it would equal what? 457. And by the way, we're using US currency. And whatever currency you are around the world, it'll change to that. So now you're building up reward credits. How do you use those reward credits? When you go purchase anything off of the booking engine, it allows you to select with money or it allows you to select reward credits. If you have enough reward credits built up, and this set, let's say we have 9,440 reward credits. And once again, in US dollars, what does that translate to? So if we did 9,440 US dollars times 0 0.01, that'd be $94.40. But can we still get a free hotel room? Well, we did a result of one night in Las Vegas. So take a look at all of the different results. Everything in green, I would get a free hotel room. Everything in red, I don't have enough credits. And you can only use reward credits or payment. It's not a combination. So in this case, on the one that requires 14,885, Technically, I would need $148 worth of reward credits to get a free room. So that's kind of how that works. So it's real easy to build up reward credits, especially through the ECHO program. Also, based upon where you are around the world, you can actually cash those in for what are called gift cards. The gift cards are predicated on the country that you reside. If it's not available in your country, it's because of regulators. Your government doesn't allow us to do it as a US-based company. So you're going to have to only use the actual uh, reward credits for free travel. Now let's move on our other product that we introduced uh, last month, uh, our, our new product that is, to me, one of the most important products in the United States market when it comes to travel. And let me give you a little background on this. I have about 28 years experience in network marketing. I've actually been a rep in four different companies similar to your experience as an ambassador. And I've been in health and wellness, I've been in skincare, I've been in technology, telecommunications, and I found my passion in travel. And what the first thing that I would tell you, just by being in this industry as long as I've been, define your passion. What are you passionate about? If you're passionate about health and wellness, focus on it. If you're passionate about skincare, focus on it. If you're passionate about travel, by all means, focus on it. Because if you build that passion and focus on that passion, you're gonna have an incredible business. And I found my passion in travel. And for the past 24 years, I've been in travel specifically with this type of a product. In the mid 90s to early 2000s, I've created some of the biggest home based travel agent programs in network marketing in the United States. Now we've created our own, and I've been able to take all of my years of experience and create something that no company has ever produced or provided. So when we talk about uniqueness in the United States, you have an opportunity of getting the best of all worlds. Yes, you're gonna build an organization and by design, but why not also build a secondary income and in travel? And when you build a secondary income and in travel, it also opens up the doors to some tremendous benefits that are way beyond what's available in the Premier Echo subscription. And to be honest, if I had a choice to make, and I'm just telling you being transparent as a by design, if I was a by design ambassador, I would 100% jump aboard on, that, on the uh, travel agent training business system. So we call this the introductory travel agent 
uh, training modules, and the travel agent business system. And we've developed a unique alliance with By Design to bring something to the market in the United States that nobody else has. Now, if you don't live in the United States, think about who you do know in the United States, right? Because you could actually get your business expanded. And there are companies out there that that's all they do is travel. And there's a couple of terrible companies that have terrible home-based agent type programs that are laughable. And they have hundreds and hundreds of agents. I mean, I'll give you an example. One organization I personally built as a sales rep of over 39,000 home-based agents in less than two years. Why? Because travel is easy to talk about. Travel is something that I could walk up to anybody and ask them the simple question. Hey, do you like to travel and are you traveling in the future? I've yet to have anybody say, no, I hate travel and no, I never am, I'm never going to travel. And even if they did, I wouldn't want to know them anyways. They're miserable people because travel not only creates memories for a lifetime, but also travel is important for your health and wellness. Do you know what the number one people are saying they want to do when this coronavirus is over? Number one, think about that. The number one survey, what's the first thing you want to do when, when corona loosens up and you're able to do what you want to do? 100% I want to travel. I want to get out. I mean, it's a no-brainer, okay? So you need to consider that this is a great opportunity in making it what I call super simple. So understand, in the United States, you have two options. You could either get your Primera Go lifestyle or you could get your travel agent training system. Now, keep in mind, for those of you that are in Latin America, I am working diligently right now to get this in Latin America in the first quarter of 2020, 2021, I should say. Then we're gonna work on getting it in Canada, and then in Australia, and then in Europe. So we will eventually get this around the world, but we gotta start in the United States, everybody, which is the best market to do it in, because this market in the United States is really geared for this type of a business concept. And there's some serious major differences in both programs. The dashboard, on your Premier Echo Lifestyle, that gives you certain benefits. The home-based agent program provides you certain benefits. Now, I'm not gonna go through all of these examples right now because we're limited on time, but join us on our uh, 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 meetings on Wednesday to learn more about the value and the differences. A question that I'm often asked, can someone make money in the travel industry? Look, even with all of the online travel agencies, like Orbitz, Priceline, Expedia, and all those companies. The home-based travel industry is thriving in the United States. There's an organization called ASTA. ASTA represents as an association of independent travel agents. And they conducted a survey last year of what people are making money part-time and full-time being in the travel industry. 34,000 US dollars part-time up to 137,000 a year full-time. Now imagine adding that to the amount of money potential you can also build in by design. So how does it work? It starts with training first. In order for you to get involved in the travel industry, you need to get trained. So we've worked out an incredible deal with by design that you can actually purchase or you can sell to somebody the travel agent training system, it's 949 and 500 BV. These are legitimate online courses created by a travel institute called Travel Campus, a partner of mine. This would normally cost in the marketplace 300 bucks. So you're saving money on that. It includes four modules, 28 courses and exams that you take at your own pace. They're all online, you take it at your own pace. We'll have this in Latin America and translate it into Spanish. So this is an incredible way to get started and, and go at your own pace. Typically, it may take up to 60 days to get through everything if you did like an hour a day. Then next, you want to earn while you learn. Now understand, and I want you to understand this, very important. By design does not sell the business opportunity. By design sells and markets the training. 
my company, Travology, that I own, I'm the owner and president, Travology markets and sells the business opportunity. So we're not a network marketing type of business. So what happens is, is that by design is referring you to come over and join me to start your travel business and earn while you learn. If you were to go to my website, travology.com, and take a look at what I normally charge for someone to become a home-based agent with me, it's $359 activation and $49.95 a month, and I get that all day long, okay? Well, Chad and the team worked out a great deal with you guys, $99 activation, and then $49.95 a month with 17 BV. You're saving over $260 between this and the training modules, which provides your in-consumer booking engine website, back office, and everything else, because that's where it starts. You get your own back office, and if you look at a section called agent tools, there's an area called VIB customers, and all you do is send out invitations. It's no different than what you're doing with an Echo. The difference is you're now making money, because how it works is when you send an invitation like an Echo, you're sending them to your agent and they create an account, log in, and they get a customer dashboard. Kind of looks familiar, right? It looks a lot like your dashboard you have for a, a Premier Echo, but this is the customer retail dashboard. So your retail customers will go into this dashboard and all the areas of stars is where you make money. Let me give you an example of what else you're able to do. You're able to provide your customers a savings. Now, it's not the amount of savings on an Echo, but remember, it's a different business model. This is about you making money in the travel industry and your customers saving money compared to going to where they would normally go. They don't even know about Echo. So if you're in the travel business and you're able to save your customer 10% on their travel, are they gonna book through you or are they gonna book through Travelocity and pay 10% more? So here's an example. Take a look at this first res or second result. This hotel here provides 144 savings. Let me ask you a question. If you sent me an invitation to be a free VIP customer, doesn't cost me anything, I register for free, and I came to your site and paid 140 and, and got $144 uh, off of my travel, Am I going to book through you, my friend, who saved me 144? Or am I going to book through Travelocity or Expedia or any of these other companies that I have no relationship with, that I don't care who they are, and I'm going to pay 144 more? Uh, no, I'm going to book travel through you. So I've now, you've helped me save money. I'm going to be happy. But how do you make money? Well, we have what's called differential and what we call commission pricing. So let's do another example. Here's seven nights in Hawaii. I'm your customer. I sign up, right, as a VIP customer. All I see is that top result. I save 10%. I save 321. But what I don't know is that there's 30% total commission. So if you even take 20%, I mean, I'm sorry, if you take 30% minus 10, that's 20% commission left over. We have commissions all the way up to 75%. No travel company on the planet has that. The average hotel commission that's paid to a travel agent in the real travel world is 10%. We have commissions up to 75. No one's ever heard anything else like that. But let's say this is 30%. Even 10% leaves 20% double what the normal travel agent makes. So if we take 972, which is 30% total commission, minus 10%, which is 321, that leaves 651 over. And you guys get to start off at the second rank called ITP, Independent Travel Professional. That's another thing that by design negotiated. You don't have to start at the bottom. You start at the middle to earn the middle income while you're going through your training. So you'd earn 70% of that 651, which is 437. What'd you do? You sent me an invitation, kind of like sending an echo. All I did was sign up for free, save money. I'm happy because I saved 321. You made 437. See how easy that is? Now here's the kicker. In the travel industry, this is why the majority of people get involved in the travel industry as a travel agent. It's called insider benefits and privileges. Yeah, the travel lifestyle echo program is great, but is nothing compared to being a travel agent. But in order to be a travel agent, 
you have to have a travel agent ID. So there's two ID cards that you'll be able to have access to. One is called I attend on the left. That requires that you've earned 5,000 in commissions in a calendar year, but then you could get started off with the introductory agent ID through an organization called CLIA representing the cruise line, which has technically the same benefits as I attend. And by the way, just this month, October 1st, we're now able to get our 2021 CLIAs. So if you join with us right now, you'll be able to sign up for CLIA, get your travel agent ID card, which not only gives you all the same discounts that we've talked about uh, with the Premier Echo lifestyle, but it opens up the doors to what are called familiarization trips that you need those ID for. Familiarization trips is called FAM trips for hotels, rental cars, resorts, tours, and cruises. Matter of fact, if you actually get IATEN status, Marriott has a program called Marriott Excellent Rewards where you can get certified through Marriott and get employee rates. That's the best rate of all employee rates at $49 to $99 a night at Marriott's all over the world. But here's the thing, everybody. The hotels are wheeling and dealing. They are wanting to get travel agents to come out to their resort. Why? Because they want to build confidence with the travel agents that their location is COVID safe, that the experience is still good. So this way the agents will do what? Go back and share it with their customers. So they're given some deals that I just blow me away that I've never seen in this industry before. And you're gonna have access to things called famrates.com and spoiledagents.com. These are resources for travel agents to get access to these unbelievable deals. Check out these name brands that are offering Fam trips. I mean, they're saying, hey, you're a travel agent. We want you to come out and check us out at these unbelievable rates because we're hoping that that's going to be our advertisement to get you comfortable in maybe becoming an expert in our location because we'd like for you to become a destination expert for Coconut Bay or Aqua or Caesars or whatever it is, right? I mean, look at these brand names. These are brand name places that are telling travel agents, hey, Come on out. We want to give you some unbelievable deals. And by the way, everybody, once again, people are booking travel now for 2021. They're jumping on the deals, okay? So there's still great money to be made. And for those of you that actually do get involved uh, as uh, a travel agent with us and get the training first and then uh, uh, join us at Travology with the Travel Agent Business System. You still get your first trip, so you're not losing anything by coming over uh, with us uh, on your Echo subscription. You can transfer it over, or if you're brand new, you could just start off with this program in the United States. Matter of fact, By Designs created a great program for you to switch over. Um, for those of you that are brand new that aren't a part of the Premier Echo Lifestyle subscription. It's $9.49 for the training and then $99 for the travel agent business system. However, if you're on the monthly Premier Echo subscription, it's reduced at $6.95. It still has $235 BV. And then the annual subscription that you may have is $345 upgraded with $115 BV. Then the next step is you contract with my company, $99, $49.95 a month, $17 BV. Now, remember I said focus, get, get your passion figured out. If I'm an ambassador and by design and my passions travel, this is my game plan for duplication and success. Simple, stupid. One plus one and you're done. What do I mean by that? You become a travel agent, 17 BV a month. I go out and find one person, maybe somebody that doesn't want to get involved as an ambassador. They just want to be a stay-at-home mom in the travel industry. And I'll tell you what, that's the number one demographic. There are so many people that want to get the travel industry that may not want to get in a networking market business. So you should celebrate that. Find people that are looking to make money in a traditional type of a business. That way they don't freak out and travel's the biggest uh, draw. So check this out. You get your 17 BV, you get a consumer to, to get the training from you, right? You're making money on that. Then they go ahead and they sign up uh, as, a, as an in-consumer agent. That 17 BV counts for you, so that's 34 BV. Now, on the comp plan, I believe at the lower, uh, lower ranks, 30 BV is where you're qualified. So it's all about making it simple and duplicatable. 
I call it the one plus one and you're done program. So I want to remind everybody that uh, we do have a, a weekly uh, workshop on this, but here's the deal. I start off with a presentation. So if you want to invite guests, invite them and I will sell them on the program. And then we conclude with a quick start training. So every week at five o'clock Pacific, seven central, eight Eastern, who do you know in the United States market? So here's the thing, we got the most incredible opportunity with by design and Travology, where the right companies with the right systems with the right opportunity and all we need is your commitment and your passion for success. So Dave, I'm gonna turn it back over to you. Well, Rob, thank you so very much. Uh, I, I, want to, I want to double check with you something that, that you and I have talked about before, and I just want to drive this point home. People come to By Design. People come to any network marketing company in the world because they have a desire to create additional financial security, either for themselves or for their families. In other words, to develop an alternative stream of income or in many cases, maybe even a primary stream of income. Basically, with what you're talking about today, it, it, to me, it's almost like having a stream of income inside of a stream of income. Um, and, and so that's the kind of double dipping that is really quite phenomenal. Um, so do you, do you agree with the way that I, the, the way that I said that? People can be building a thriving by design business, taking all of the advantages of the financial rewards plan. But on top of that, they can also take advantage of the travel opportunities that you're talking about to create yet another stream of income. Are you okay with me describing it that way? Yeah, but I would take it one step further. You know, being in network marketing, Dave, as you know, a lot of people run out of their warm market in a hurry, right? right? You may have heard the terminology, the NFL Hall of Fame, no friends left, right? Because you've actually gone out there and expired everyone you know. Right. One thing that I found over the years in this industry is the average person really doesn't feel comfortable with sales and it's difficult for them to go out and, and you know, approach new people. But let me tell you something, the way that if you work this correctly, I got a system in place to show you how travel could be the biggest lead generation system in the history of network marketing, because I've proven it over and over again, that generates those leads on the front end to entice them with travel. Now they're connected and guess what? You're able to introduce them to everything else. Once you've gained their trust through travel, it opens up the doors to other opportunities. And so to your point, it provides a way to generate income on something people are already going to do with or without you. So why not help them save money anyways? You've got a business card. That's how simple this is, okay? And we're going to entice them to save money. They're going to join you. And now you've got their information to say, hey, let me tell you about what's going on with this other opportunity called by design. You know, so it's, it's a, like you said, it's the ultimate opportunity to make money and by design, build an organization, make money in travel, and then also save additional money on things that you cannot get unless you're in the travel industry. Right. Plus the lead generation system that you were just talking about on top of all that. So, well, thank you so very much. Incredible, incredible information today. You've, you've literally filled the entire amount of time, which is fantastic. Um, so thank you, Rob, again for, for being with us tonight.